Are we there? Wow. All right. Yeah, the team is uh, the team is together, but the team is separated. I'm in California doing this, and um, you guys are there with some nasty weather. Trying yep. to hang in there, and if you're just waking up, I guess uh, we got quite a bit of snow last night, so be careful. Be careful driving in. Yeah, winter driving conditions are not great. Yeah. So we need to talk about something that happened on uh, Friday Friday show. There was a huge announcement that was made. Uh, everybody was uh, in the dark on this. Surprised. We had no clue what was going on. Did we see hints of something happening? Yeah, we did. She says that um, we should have seen it. It was in, uh, right in front of us when we were at the Froghead Beer Party at Roga Tavern. Johanna wasn't drinking, didn't think nothing of it. She said, I'm DD. And I said, okay, that sounds, that sounds good to me. Got to pick up on the little signs. And then she got me. She got me. She got me. She got me my worst moment. On Friday, we, uh, we did what's in the box. She built, 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 built it up. It was beautifully done. Got to give her credit on the execution. It was wonderfully done. She put some water in a cup and said it was her urine, which is disgusting. And let me put my fingers all in it. And then uh, sitting down beside it was a pregnancy test. And, and I didn't know it until I felt it. Now, there were two reactions on Friday to the news on the radio. One was Kenny's. No, I'm sorry. No, one was Kyle's. Kyle's. One was Gary's. <laughs> Mm. I didn't know until I went back and listened. I went back and listened to the show on Friday. So mm. much so that what did I do, Kyle, uh, for you on Friday? Uh, you called and apologized. I did. I thought I was rude to him. You apologized to Kyle, but you didn't apologize you to me. Didn't call I called you right afterwards. He didn't right apologize to me. He called me to ask me to do something for the show. That is not true. Yes, that is. You called me literally to say, we should pull the reaction of Kyle and the reaction of me. I went back and listened, and I didn't, I didn't sound that bad. That's what this is for, Johanna. Oh, thank That's you. That's what we're doing right oh, now. Okay, but I cannot believe you apologize to Kyle. I cannot believe that. Can you play, Kyle, your reaction first of when you find out? Do you have that there? Yep. When you find out that Johanna was pregnant on Friday. Because you're not drinking next week? Nope. I am not. What? I'm pregnant. No. Yeah. Are you serious? Yes. No way. Yes. Oh, my gosh. Yes. I didn't know a better way to tell everybody. Oh. So this Thanks, Kyle. Mm -hmm. That's the way it's supposed to be done right there. That's a friend. That's a friend on a friend right there. Friend, friend action right there. Congratulations. So happy for you. I know. And I was excited. I was thrilled she wanted to share that with us. Yeah. It's nice. And then I found out that you were pregnant, and the reaction was a little different, I think. Pre pregnancy you test. <laughs> <laughs> please, t please tell me you're not pregnant again. <laughs> you're pregnant again. <laughs> I know I'm supposed to be happy for you, but we're down a I soldier. I you want to be happy. <laughs> oh, my God. Do you hear me crying? Do you hear the tears in my voice? Oh, my gosh. I went back, actually, to watch your face. I was trying to figure, I was trying to pick up on it. I wasn't sure what was going on. I was, uh, that was not a good moment for me. That was not a good moment for me. Mm. You have sad music, Kyle? I don't know if you have sad music there or not. Wrong mouth. It's hard, Hold to, on. It's hard to find <laughs> on, that, uh, on that wall, isn't it? Uh, do you ever want to have a redo reaction? Does anybody ever do that? No. Johanna, are you always good at your initial reactions? I don't think you should be allowed. Why? Because that's your, your initial reaction like that is your true reaction. So people know your true feelings. I know. But if you go back and dissect it, if you go back and dissect it, it was, it was more me being worried about the show because you're such a talented person. You're so good at what you do on the radio. And I knew that we were going to be, uh, there was going to be a void that was going to be missing when you, when you're gone. Now at the same time, this is a struggle going on inside of my body. Cause at the same time, I'm like, God, I'm so happy for her. This is an incredible oh, you, thing. There was never a Jeez. moment of I'm so happy for her. Not once was there a moment. You said, she I'm supposed to be happy for you. You said, I'm supposed to, you literally admitted that you were not happy. I said to myself, I cannot believe she got a little guy inside her right now. She's she's growing something inside of her. What a beautiful thing. Okay. Oh my God, it's incredibly beautiful. I screwed up. It was a terrible reaction. And I am so I am really sorry. All right.
I really am. I probably should apologize to your husband too. I know we're getting Big Daddy Dane on here in just a minute. I text, I texted him, congratulations. Yeah, I know, I know. I, you told my husband congratulations, but not even me. Yes, I did. I didn't. No, say you did tone, not. Right? No, you never. I really am happy for you. I really am. I really, I really am happy for you. Uh, we're gonna be fine, just like you said a hundred times on Friday. We're gonna be fine. <laughs> Everything's gonna be fine. It's all gonna be fine. Did you stress me out? I have the biggest zit I've ever had in my life on my forehead, and I know it's because of last weekend. Kenny, you don't look over at me. I just. <laughs> <laughs> you're listening to Froggy ninety eight. Check us out while you're out at. What? There's something... Yeah, Andy Wilson, wrong. whatever your name is, we know it sounds like poo poo. What? Uh, There's something wrong with the equipment over here. Why? What do you mean? I got. I'm not even. I got the mouse up here, and it's moving all over. The... <laughs> <laughs> Where is the? Uh... It's just like. There's a. There's a mouse with a cord on it. If you need to. I gotta Gary. I gotta Gary it right now. I gotta pull up the Should comments on my phone. You know what? Who actually is the really good friend? Oh, I don't even want to. You know what? This is what a real mean? show. This is a real show. Let's make it yeah. really real. Yeah. I held back tears so many times during that because I didn't want to make you look bad. I'm trying. Yes. And then on top of that. On top of that, I've had to respond to so many messages of people telling me how mean you were to me. And I had to stick up from a friend, kind of, but also not stick up. Yeah. Why? What do you mean? Oh, my God. You're a good friend, Joanna. <laughs> <laughs> you are. You're a good friend. <laughs> okay. It's not, it's not a moment I'm proud of. <laughs> But can I give? I want to give you an example of something, no. and and maybe maybe this will let you see it through my eyes just for a moment, okay? And just hear me out here for a second, okay? If I did what's in the box for you, now this is not apples to apples, but it kind of is in a roundabout way. If I did uh, what's in the box for you, and in that box you had no idea what it was, but there was sand in the bottom of it. And you're like you sand? What the heck is this? Okay. No, this... no, 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 no. There's sand in the bottom of it, right? Okay. okay, sand. And then there's a letter in there, too. And you're like, well, what's the letter? And you get the letter, and the letter is my resignation that I'm, I'm quitting. Because that I'm retiring. not the same at all. No, no, listen, you can compare know, it with a vacation, but you cannot compare it with quitting. Because the moment you compare it with quitting, you act like like me. You know, this is what is really irritating. If it's you, not you if you were having a baby or Kyle was having a baby, everybody would be happy because you're not the woman with the uterus. That was irritating to me because I'm the one who has has a burden burden of carrying no. a child. No burden. No, that's not what I'm saying. I'm not saying that this is the same like you're leaving the show. That, that that's not, not the, same. the same. But when I'm tell no, I know that's not what I'm saying at all. What I'm saying is is that, that you know you don't want me to quit. You don't want me to retire, right? No, I don't. And I'm right. And so if you found out that way and what's in the box, your reaction probably wouldn't be, I'm so happy for you. That you're <laughs> no, I literally you get to go to the beach every day. Listen, no, you'd be like, what? You're quitting. Why are you quitting? I literally said to multiple people and my own husband, the first thing I said is I understand because if he told me he was going on vacation and potentially it could be a six week vacation, I would be upset. Yeah. So I do understand. But it's but a I'm, baby. Time, I know. <laughs> but at the same time, Johanna, I am truly, truly happy for you. I know, I know that you're an incredible mom and, and motherhood is so important to you. And it didn't come off that way on Friday. And I regret that <laughs> because I was. Yeah, I you think know, you said I'm a like, bad mom. Like, no. You said I mean, another I'm, one. No, another you're poor an baby. Incredible mom. No, you're a great mom. <laughs> but that's like here, you know, I don't listen. As much as I love my job, I'd rather be in bed right now. But I know that you want me to be on, you know, so I'm on. That's I because I like working with you just as much as you, I think, enjoy probably working with me. So or it's is it a selfish you feel moment. like you owe me. You feel like you owe me from Friday. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. You, you said you were going to do this before you found out. Oh, this? Like, no, this yeah, isn't a payback. No. No. Uh, no way. Yeah, well. That's fine. It's, well, what can you do now? You know, <laughs> I can't really take it back. I'm knocked <laughs> up. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I want to listen to this. What? How you sound? So no, you don't want to hear. Oh, do you want me to call Dane? I didn't even call him. Listen to this. What? How you sound? 
That's not terrible. That's, That's what I've been trying to tell you. It's not terrible. <laughs> you want me to call Dan or what? Yeah, I'm trying to call him right now. <clears throat> I forget that he's... How do, how do men sleep through everything? My phone oh. literally like goes off for an email and I'm like, huh? This is now oh. we'll all know what it'll be like if I have an emergency. <laughs> what Dane, I'm having the baby. <laughs> oh, that would be not good. That's an emergency, right? Gotta go. He's not gonna answer me. Don't you think my number should be like a psycho sound? Should be loud. Yeah. Should be like an alarm. I wish my kids had a phone. Hide alerts. Follow would answer. Hi. Don't. <laughs> <laughs> I love that voicemail. He says he sounds like a little kid. <laughs> it's really cute. It's a cute one, though. Nobody wants someone to say your husband's voicemail is cute. Who wants? <laughs> <laughs> oh man. I don't even have a voicemail. I should probably have a voicemail. I don't think I do either. I think mine's probably full. I think it's better not to have one, really, and just have the. Why? Automated. I don't know. Like your phone <laughs> number. No like reason. you've just, no, yeah, no reason. It sounds better, I think. <laughs> Can you believe this? He's not gonna answer. I need him to answer. What's up, John or Deb? Deb's birthday is this week. It's Wednesday, isn't it? Happy birthday. Happy birthday. How do you know that? Because I appreciate the camp fam and I take note of special days in their lives. Oh my gosh. I'm about to be a single mom. Who's watching the kids? Dang. <laughs> <laughs> they're all sleeping though, right? Yeah, they're sleeping. And <clears throat> call him. Will you call him on that phone? Yeah. He's not going to answer, is he? I'm just going to keep sending him texts. Is that more annoying? Ding, ding. Ding, 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 ding. Answer, please. He doesn't. It's okay. If he doesn't come on, we can. Do you have it? Oops. Apparently, when I share contacts with people, it shares the picture I have set for them. Because that <laughs> that's the picture I have set for Dane. And I must Which share one? the contact when with I you. I say you? No, I have a no, no. I should do that one. It's a yeah, much I love cuter that picture. One. <laughs> that one reminds me of Shallow Hal, the one I have of him. Yeah, it does. It makes me feel like a good person, you know, doing my work, for my charity work. <laughs> yeah. Oh gosh. Big daddy dang, big daddy dang, big daddy dang. Hi, Don't this is play Dan. the voice. <laughs> I'm unable to get to your call at this time. What does it sound like to you? I don't so understand. Cute. We no, don't I have do the this. same I'm not ears. Talking it. it sounds really cute. That's all I'm saying. There's nothing <laughs> cute about it. 20 seconds, I think. I wish he on this point now. He's not answering his wife. LOL. I know, Becca. This is a problem. If I had a true serious emergency, who would I call now? Who would I call? My mom's dead. Know. My husband doesn't answer. <laughs> <laughs> the Tracy's Collision Cam is live. Facebook.com slash Froggy981. Just uh, uh, check in if we can. Johanna, any cravings? Is there any uh, oh, anything we can do gosh. for you? Any uh, Dean uh, Kenny? Kenny's sitting in the studio now. He doesn't have a. Uh, I don't know if he's participating on air. Can he rub your feet? I want a margarita. Margarita, Kenny. <laughs> you can't have one. <laughs> you cannot have one. Uh, virgin, yeah, virgin one, I guess. I don't need you to do this. This is not something I need you to do. This I, is what you're gonna get from here to August. I, I don't want it. it. I don't want it. 
You can't now. And also, I really did want my husband to come back on. To come on, I mean. Because I wanted him to tell you what it was like after I left the show. I don't want to know. Why would I want to know that? I'll have him. We'll get him on eventually to this morning. He can. <laughs> yeah, he's not answering his phone right now. No, which is terrible. Awful. What a terrible husband right now. That's what I'm saying. And why would you mess with me right now? I want to mess with me normal <sighs> me, but definitely not hormonal me. Yeah, you scared me. Mess with- yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is going to be a long. Well, be I don't want to hear it. I've been pregnant for, I'm almost 17 weeks and you guys didn't even know. So I don't want to no hear idea. it. No idea. No um, idea. To be fair though, he didn't know he was supposed to be home this morning, did he? No, I honestly, after Friday, just kind of decided I wasn't going to think about radio for the whole weekend. <laughs> <laughs> we got to come. We have to come to an agreement on this. I don't know what I need to do. What? You tell me. What? What you need to do? After Friday, yes, so we can oh, move forward. Oh, yeah, I'll think of something good. We'll be fine for now, but I'm going to, th- I just want you to know that I still, like, you still owe, you have an IOU in your pocket for me. Okay, I'll pay it up, whatever it is. I know. Cash, I got to think. I don't know. Cash, cash. No, I don't Jump know. that, Joanna. <laughs> no way. No, it's she too full easy. time. Listen, it's too easy for him. $50. Cash is easy. <laughs> it was a $50 apology. 50 bucks? <laughs> Dude, that's tempting. That's a box of diapers. Yeah, but the fifty dollars. If I give it to you, that means you can never bring it up again. No, it's not yeah, worth it for me. No. No. Fifty dollars ain't worth it. Not worth it for me. You gotta no. have that in your back pocket at all times. <laughs> I know. God darn it. Uh, but does that expire after the baby comes? No. Or is this a lifetime? Hey, back can you pocket? talk about um, when you told like your dad and stuff? Like other family members, were they all surprised and? Yeah, so we told Dane's family, I had this whole plan where I was going to, we had them all over for dinner on Fat Tuesday. That's why we did that dinner. Oh, okay. To tell them all. But I was like, okay, I'm going to make shirts for the kids that say like best big brother ever, best big sister ever. And so I was like all crafty mom making these shirts for them and and they were just going to like show up and then if they read the shirts, they'd figure it out eventually. Well. I I needed to clean the house, and I can't do it with the kids, so I had to send the kids with a grandparent. So then the kids weren't even there when people were showing up. So then they came back, and then I had to change them. It was really, it was not how oh I envisioned God. it at all. Yeah, so yeah. then they walked out, and everybody's like, why did you guys change their shirts? <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> I was like, I don't know. But, um, yeah, so, I mean, we just told them, and then my dad, we Zoomed him, and he was in the bathtub, and <laughs> it was really... He was in the bathtub? He answered the Zoom in the bathtub. No, no, he didn't answer the Zoom. He didn't answer the Zoom, and it was the night before, it was Thursday night before I was going to tell everybody on the radio, I was like, no, he has to answer, because I have to yeah. tell him. And then I called him, and he, and he, I was like, why didn't you answer my Zoom? And so then I started, or I started FaceTiming him. And then he's like, as he's answering, he's like, I'm in the bathtub. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, well, don't go any lower, please. No, no, no. Sure. <laughs> Things happen, and you may have missed. Uh, clear, clear, clear. One person has been confirmed dead in a crash this morning that oh closed my Highway gosh. 2. Oh gosh. Highway <gasps> 2 and 176th Street. Is that the highway I drive? No. no. Oh, good. 176th Street, so that's way out. That's six like, miles um, east of Lincoln. Yeah, on that way too. Oh, oh that's a great yeah. idea, Colleen. Sorry. What Colleen say? I think Gary should throw you an amazing baby shower planet, invite people, pay for food and beverage. <laughs> At his house. <laughs> we'll plan it for sure. No, you have to plan it, pay for it, and plan everything. Plan and pay for it. Plan and pay, planning is paying for it. Planning's yeah. paying for it. Yes, it is. What are you going to do? Ask me for my credit card? No. <laughs> no, I do cover charge. Can you do cover charge? <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm not going to my own shower. <laughs> you get him free. I gave you a free pass. <laughs> I get a free ticket. We'll get you a meet and greet as well. Oh my god. <laughs> <Thanks. laughs> I love it. A meet and greet. That's a great idea. Oh my gosh. Oh, she would hate it we, if it was like we can a have a radio feed. station. We we should do that. The problem is you run the risk of nobody showing up. You know, like you think that a lot of people would, and I think camp fan members would. It'd be good content, me crying. Yeah, like that's not good content. We got a lot of numbers the last time I cried. The last two times I've cried. <laughs> I've only seen cry once. Three times. So you're saying you want to do Facebook Live baby okay. shower? One time, real cry, nobody was watching. That was not good. Second time was f- 
crying from the rabbit. That was a lot of crying. That was a lot of a lot of people were concerned. Yeah. Third time, Gary says, "I hate you. You're pregnant." And then yeah, I was crying. Again. That's not true. That <laughs> you, you're skipping one. I am. Yeah. I cried another time. Yeah. You well, maybe that was the first one you're talking about. The first one you're I'm talking about is nobody was watching that one. Were no, they? then no, you're not. You're forgetting one. What one? The time you cried because of somebody's comment to you. Yeah. That's what that I'm talking I read, about. I read the comment. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, I thought I'm, some. I thought, I'm not oh. saying that. That wasn't record numbers. People weren't like, like flocking um, to the camera. I, I forgot about the record number. Part. That's what I was talking about. Yeah. I mean, people were watching, but it wasn't like great. Oh. I have that screen recorded somewhere to pull it up to whenever I need to. Oh, here he is. What if I was dying? I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a child. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, he says. I your phone. <laughs> Honey, but for real, this is concerning. What if there was an emergency? I would be dead by now. What if I was like, I have 10 minutes to die? I would have died. Well, you'd like me calling you if I was in an emergency. Well, I answer you. What are you talking no, about? No. You don't have any proof of that. I always answer. No, you don't. Yes, I do. You wake me up from a naps, and it drives me crazy. Johanna, I called you like six times yesterday when I was out running. Oh, errands. that is so true. You got me. <laughs> <laughs> you got me. You got me. You got me. Okay, well, we don't need you anymore. She got pregnant. But you brain. can tell Gary just really briefly how uh, our phone call went after I left the radio station on Friday. You want me to... Really tell him about that? Probably not, but you can just say like just one word. The PG version. Just one word. Couldn't breathe. <laughs> Couldn't breathe. Yeah. My comb. Uh, why do you think? She's so upset. Mm. She's crying so hard. And I was angry. <laughs> and one. Very and, angry. And he was upset. See? Yeah. Can you hear me? <laughs> no, he can't hear you. Oh, you tell him. No, I'm sorry. Gary says he's sorry. And I'm happy for you guys. And he's but happy. I'm not the one that he needs to be apologizing to. It's a great point, honey. That's I what told I said, too. Johanna, I am sorry. Listen, <laughs> here's the thing. Is it, Dane, can you, can you stress to him that it's more about how much I love working with you? And you have to separate it. It's not about the baby. I'm so happy we for know. the baby part of it. Gary, we know all these parts. You know how many excuses I gave you on Friday? That's not an excuse. That's for real. It's for real. I know, but still. <laughs> like, this, those six weeks are going to be... I'm just going to put a picture of you in there. <laughs> <laughs> we could put it right above the calendar. Just have Philo come in. <laughs> you should have the kids come in. There you go. Philo would be really good at it. She's just like me. Okay, well, honey, I don't need you anymore. Okay. Okay, love you. Bye. I don't know how to get out of this on my phone. You're going to have to hang up. Okay. Okay, bye. <laughs> Why are you calling Dane if you're dying? Call the ambulance. That's a good point. No, just wanted to say I love you one more time. <laughs> uh... No, I'd call him just to, like, yell at him one last time. He caught me there, though. Man, I was not answering his phone calls at all when he was running errands. Uh, oh, my God. That's the worst, when you're running errands and you're trying to do things, and you're mm -hmm. like, well, I just I have one question. Am I getting the right thing or the wrong thing? I know. Okay, our person. They're not joining? No, she said she could call. I made it. It's okay. Whatever it is, it is. <sighs> That's fine. Okay. She said she doesn't have Zoom at work. I said, okay. Um. We can just have her. We'll just call her. Yeah. Oh my gosh! I just spelled number wrong. <laughs> Number? <laughs> yeah. That's embarrassing. <laughs> I'm a real person. He's not going to think it's a real person. 
I saw my Aunt Candace. She was on here watching. Yeah. I wonder if she's still watching. Your Aunt Candace was watching? Did yeah. you tell all your family that you were running the board? No. I wouldn't either. <laughs> <laughs> Took about, a, took about an hour to get warmed up. Oh my gosh! You know what? I would be. Let me just be real with you. You're doing a great job, but like you doing it and you have experience makes me never want to do it, ever. You know how bad it'd be. But it wouldn't be. It would just be for a couple of times, and you get it. It's not that hard. So this is a guy who's been doing the same buttons for how many years? I know, but there's not. There's not that many buttons. It's the same. It's the same <laughs> stuff every day. <laughs> It's that. like the cameras. Are the cameras that hard, Kyle? No. No, but I don't know how to do them. Guys. I'd screw it up. Bad. You want to talk about, like, just sitting here with your face on the camera? Not that bad. <laughs> <laughs> your job is not easy. Your job is hard. <laughs> uh, yeah. Super difficult. See, what's nice is we'll be able to show you the way to do it with like the cams and everything on i don't want to learn until but we I, get the new board are we yeah. getting a new board yeah yeah i'm not no, i'm not yeah, learning but they're not going to put that in for a lot of reasons right now so oh so i have to learn this one still yeah so like i know a lot of buttons i came in here all by myself that one night and figured it out was i really scared that i was doing that sexy thing i was recording a live on air yeah i was <laughs> <laughs> Well, it's not that difficult. I need some coffee bad. I'm so sorry. I do feel bad for you. You shouldn't. Don't feel bad. I don't want you to feel bad for me forever. Never, ever, <laughs> ever feel bad for me. I don't. I don't ever want it. Well, if you even start, I'm going to say don't do it because this is why. Oh, man. This would be better. This is so, like, if I do be extra, extra attentive to you and, like, really feel bad for you and all these things, you're going to feel worse. Yeah, probably. It's <gasps> a great plan. I love it. The soundboard looks old and outdated. Thanks, Amar. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Does it still work? Yes. Can you 3D print as a new one? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh. Okay. I think there's nothing more annoying than wearing socks that don't fit the way they should oh no what are they, are they the sliding small, they're the yeah. small ones aren't they they're footies, no. they're footies yeah they're not footies oh, no. they're dress socks <laughs> yeah, you wear dress socks with a t-shirt okay, okay. i need all our socks we just we did laundry throughout the weekend and they're all the socks are in a bucket and so we haven't divided and conquered the socks and so i just found some dress socks and i was reminded why i don't wear them anymore because they Slide down my freaking shins into my ankles. Oh my gosh, I did. Just... And guys wear those one socks that uh, girls wear with heels, not heels. Yes, like the, the little the hideaway ones. You know what I'm talking We've about. We've talked to Kyle about this before. I think Kyle has some. I wear those. Yes. Man. <laughs> <laughs> you wear them to bed? No, I don't wear them to bed. I don't wear them to bed. I wear them when I have like, uh, like if I'm wearing like my dress pants that are a little short, like so they'll show a little ankle. You don't want the you don't want the socks showing. That looks terrible. Yeah. I understand that, and you seem like someone who has like slides. So you I know wear what with I mean? my dress shoes. Yeah, I can see that. I can see that for sure. Slides? What slides got to do 15. with those? Like shoes that are like you just slide on. I just call them slides. Loafers. <laughs> loafers. <laughs> the loafers. I don't know. The Tracy's Collision Cam is live. Search Frog Mornings on YouTube. We got our worst state of the week coming up, don't we? Yeah, we do. Am I supposed to call her now? I don't no. know. No, okay. no, next, no, no. We next, tease. Next, next. This is a tease. <laughs> Johanna is going to tell us a little bit about the story, and then we're going to get the uh, worst date of the week person on to tell us all the details. Uh, this is the problem about telling you about this story. Is I think I started getting it confused. I think I had in my head that this was a diff the person I had booked for next week. But the one thing I know about this story is... It has something to do with a breathalyzer. 
Oh, okay, this is good. <laughs> yeah. That's all I know. I know nothing more. I have literally in my notes, that's it, breathalyzer. So. <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> so you don't know who was breathing into it, though. It's got to be no, him, right? No, I don't know it if it's him be. or her or how it happened or is it like, what, did he have it in his car? You know what I mean? Oh, like, did, did he, he already have a DUI it? and then have it in his car? <sighs> or is it like, did they get pulled over and had to do a breathalyzer test with the police? That'd be terrible. Oh, it's embarrassing. You got to walk the line and touch the nose. What is start? Oh. oh, boy. That's not hot, is it? No, no. I would love if we got someone who actually was like the terrible date. Like, yeah, like... I got a DUI. I was a terrible, like, <laughs> right. I was, you know, I want that person to share the story. I think there's a handful of guys that will come on and do that, but most are not. Yeah. You know, most, of, most of the stories that we've heard doing this, why would they come on to say, yeah, that was me? <laughs> know, we got some really good tickets to give away coming up here. We might, get, <laughs> yeah, that's we, true. We might have some people admit some stuff. Okay. When uh, we come back, we're going to have uh, the worst date of the week. Uh, guest on and she'll tell the rest of the story. We'll do that next. Froggy 98. As you're scrolling in Kyle. Yes, ma'am. I really like the thought of thought of that. Yeah. Um, like I'm the worst to date. Yeah, I'm like, the worst know, to date. Something like that. Yeah. Like, oh, yeah, that's good. Yeah. I'm going to write it down. Um, don't R-I-D-S, date me. But, <laughs> like I'm the worst to date. Yeah, like, I'm the worst know, to date. Something like that. Yeah. Like, oh, yeah, that's good. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's good. <laughs> <laughs> it just seems hollow here. It is hollow there. You should hear it without the microphone. It sounds real. Bleh. That's why I put the blanket over my head. Don't no, worry. No, it did though. nothing. It did. It did worse things. I don't sounds know. Sounds like you're in a stall at a bathroom. Maybe if you had like mic. a like a blank real blanket. Could you imagine? There's <laughs> people there's, come down for the, breakfast. Yes, and there's they, a blanket they, over him. Like. Oh, then he's definitely looking at naughty stuff. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm in the breakfast room. It's. What time is it? Sir, here? the s- security. I Why do you believe- have a blanket on? I have to say, I am really, 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 really thankful you're doing this. I can't believe you're doing it. I did it for you. I know. I'm very thankful. Not for you, Kyle, or for Kenny. <laughs> I did it for you, Joanna. <laughs> Thank you. It means more to me that you agreed to do this before you found out the bomb. Because it means we're actually really friends. Gary's in California. Yeah, because there's, there's a lot of tricks in this friendship, it sounds like. I, I got to be careful where I step, don't I? What do you mean? Not tricks, but like, uh, why did he do this? Did he do it for this reason? Are we really friends? Are we this or that or the other? I got to be careful. Okay. Wh- okay. So you're saying it was like the way I feel is it merited based on how you react? It is that? merited. I, oh, this okay. Is, what do you mean? Which part? I'm confused now. I just stepped in it, I think. <laughs> you're acting like you're confused why I was upset. No, not at all. You're justified in that. I'm not that's not what I'm talking about. Oh, you're just saying in general? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Why you got why you got you out of the hole and you go put yourself back in? I don't understand. <laughs> Doesn't make any sense. Uh, hey Kenny. You doing all right, bud? Yeah, I'm doing great. You yeah. just well dazing off into the uh Abyss? Are you just reading the comments? No, I was reading the comments. He's just hanging out. I like it. Yeah. Kenny, I think you were in my dreams the other night. Hello. <laughs> Welcome. <Yeah>. Welcome. Welcome. <laughs> Come on, Kenny. Kenny, if you had to be, is his microphone on? Yeah. If you had to be in any of our dreams, which one would you want it to be in? Mine, Kyle's, or Johanna's? <laughs> Probably Johanna's. <laughs> <laughs> well, you made it, buddy. You yeah. die happy. I don't know what you were doing. Oh, I think it was like a work happy. thing. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was a work thing. No, it was that same dream where we were uh, swinging. It was the cruise. We had a work cruise. How cool would that be? We I had a work cruise. A work cruise, yeah. And we were swinging. I'll take a Christmas party. I was swinging. <laughs> <laughs> we'll take a Christmas party. Literally, there's been one Christmas party <laughs> since I've worked had here. One of the years. Literally, yeah. the first year I was working here, we had one. That's yeah. and you didn't even go. And it was, <laughs> <laughs> was that the one yeah. at the gala? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Or maybe it was my. It must have been my second year working here then, because you haven't been here as long as me, right? I've been here for three years. Well, total of five. Because okay, I was with I've Red six. for two. Yeah. Okay. Was uh, I here before Kyle? Or was Kyle here? At- you know, I don't know. I'll be six years in September. No, then you were October. here before. Yeah. Were you here when Nikki was here? Yes. Okay. 
Yeah. And Kyle was too, and then Kyle left. Mm -hmm. I know. Yeah. I remember Kyle being here, and then I remember you coming and leaving. Weird. Wow, we've lived a lot of lives together, boys. We've seen some things. <laughs> uh, oh, man. What um, time is it? 7.45? 5.45. Get till 6.30, I think. Can't you take a nap when you're done? You can take a nap. Yeah, I can. I you're just right. need coffee. <laughs> I know. That really sucks. Would you drink, like, a cold one? Yeah, I asked her for that. She took point me to the water. There isn't, like, a machine in there? No, there's nothing. I bet you, yeah, there's got to be a vending machine on the floor next to the ice machine. Yeah, with, like, a Starbucks mm -hmm. in there or something. Yeah. I don't think so, guys. <laughs> Gary, bet you, do you have one thousand percent there is. Do they have oranges? <laughs> there ain't nothing in here. Can you not see by me? It looks behind you to my left. Looks like there's like a tray of apples. Nothing. But Other on the way. plus side, Gary. Oh, never mind. What's that in that? Question? Is that when that breakfast starts to come out, you're gonna oh, get some fresh food? That's a really nice little table decoration. Is I feel like kids aren't allowed at that motel. <laughs> <laughs> it is uh, pretty nice. I don't know what that is. It looks like something from Superman where he lived. Superman. Did you guys already do your shopping down Rodeo? No, we can do no Rodeo shopping, Kyle. Gary's like, oh, we're going to go down the Rodeo Drive right there. You know what I mean, man? Well, I don't believe how many people are out here, though. Yeah. What do you mean? I guess it's a big city. Where is the, where is, I want to go to the scary place. Skid Compton? Row. Skid Row. Skid, oh, Skid Row. Skid Row. Oh. <laughs> That's where I would want to go. I want to go look for that one girl, the Baywatch girl. She in Venice, she's though, is in she? there. No, yeah. I don't know where. Oh, yeah, she's in Venice. Yeah. I don't know if, in relation to what that is, but I bet she visits Skid Row. No, it's a walk. Is I mean, it? <laughs> it's a pretty good walk. <laughs> she's got time. <laughs> she's got a lot of time. I've seen them like build houses, like they build legit houses yeah. out of like scraps. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. They, I, I was the following house. this one guy's story on Tik TikTok, and he built a two-story house just like on the sidewalk. Out of what? Just like wood and like uh, cardboard. <laughs> I uh, don't know. I don't know. But then I think he got too much fame, and they finally tore it down. What's on the agenda today, Gary? What are you guys going to do? We're going to drive around the city. Go to, I think we're going to go to uh, the Santa Monica Pier. Pier. Take, um, do a little Ferris wheel ride? Yeah, just kind of some more, just mess around. You know you're balling when you can afford a rental car in California. It wasn't that bad, actually. Really? Yeah. Come on. Uh, like $6 a gallon, I think, more. Oh, gas is ridiculous. Yeah. That's insane. Mm -hmm. No, 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 no. The worst part of that trip is going to be filling up that rental car before you return it. We got a camera. It won't be too bad, I don't think. <laughs> you have to <clears throat> fill it up before oh, you return it. Oh, Kyle, yeah, I got to fill it up before I return it. Oh, well, that sucks. Do you have a worse date of the week, bed? Yeah, that's what I was telling you. It's that days of our lives are... It's uh, you just play it an audition. It's on the left side of the wall. We should probably call her, huh? Yeah. God darn. Left side of the wall. Yeah, yeah there it is. Kitty, 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 kitty. Boom. Let's go. Boom. Got a minute forty. Mm. I want a pedicure, Deb. That sounds like so. Oh good. goodness gracious! Um, Great balls of fire. <laughs> Those don't go together. That sounds like they should. Goodness gracious! Great balls of fire. Yes, they do. Goodness gracious! Great balls of fire. Is that right? <laughs> <laughs> now you're making me second guess. That sounds like they should. I'm overdriven still, you guys. We know that. That's. Why don't you guys tell me? Because every button you press, it doesn't change anything. Have you not pressed all the buttons? I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I don't know what I pressed. I have no idea. <laughs> is this different? Is this different? Is this different? Oh, okay. And it all sounds the same. Hey, Hi. is this Deborah? Hello. Hey, it's Kyle and Johanna and Gary and Kenny with Froggy98. <laughs> 
A lot of you. Yeah. There is. We're going to talk to you about your, we're going to have you tell your worst date story here in just like, um, how, how soon, Kyle? Uh, 30 seconds. In 30 seconds. Okay. Perfect. Awesome. What's her name again? Debra. Do you go by hey, Debra? Uh, you... Yeah. Perfect. Listen, I should probably not talk a lot if it sounds that bad. No, you're doing fine, Gary. I think it sounds No, I know I'm doing fine, but it did not sound good. It sounds distorted. It doesn't sound bad in my headphones. Okay. <laughs> okay, well, I can, you can, you get into it and I'll help you. Take it home. Take her that's home. Not, no, that's mean. not what I'm saying. <laughs> Listen to your favorite morning show on the Tracy's Collision Camp. Every morning. Just head over to Facebook. <laughs> Facebook.com slash Froggy 981. We're state of the week. Deborah joins us now. Deborah, can you hear us? Yes. Johanna, what do we know about this story before we hear from Deborah? Uh, Deborah, I don't have all my notes on your story. I just know that I was severely interested when you told me. And in my notes, I wrote breathalyzer. Yes. Okay. That was one of the many highlights of the day. <laughs> many <laughs> highlights. <laughs> I, I, had, I came on, why am I still single or whatever? <gasps> and got Please. stood up by the guy. Nope. Sorry, we're going to have to ask Wait, you. wait, wait a second. Is this whole story about a guy we hooked you up with? Your worst date story is a guy we no, hooked you up with? No, I got, I, I, that guy stood me up. I met up, the guy that I'm talking about is one that also got stood up and we went out together. Oh. He was on oh. Oh, I'm still single, too. <laughs> <laughs> but I found out why he was still single. So. <laughs> yeah, let's oh, hear it. why? Yummy. So, um, mm. He had t- I told him I got stood up. He had told me he got stood up. And we went to La Paz. Great food. And I think we had met there, I think. Or he might have picked me up. I can't remember. Um, but just the whole day, talked about being born again, a born again Christian, religion, something I don't think someone should discuss on a first date, religion, politics, all that. Right. Um, that's more of like a third date, fourth date, maybe down the road type thing. But, uh talking about a born again christian and all this stuff and we're just going to drive around kind of cruise around in his work truck (laughs) and got in his work truck and before we could start the truck he had to blow it blow into the breath of life at that point i'm just like "Mm, okay yeah this this date's like more than over Deborah, did he say anything before he started breathing into it? Like, did he nope. explain it? Nope, he just did it. He just did it. What if he and was? I, <laughs> yeah, like, it's I didn't know what water. to say, and I'm just like, oh, oh, okay. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go home now. It makes a lot of sense why he was like severely hitting down on the. He's a born again Christian. Yeah, yeah. He's trying to yeah, like and, uh, counteract. After that, I just, I was like done with the date and. uh he would send me not suitable for work pictures, and I'm just like, is, uh, is somebody oh. that's a born again Christian do this? So it's just, <laughs> yeah, it was just a hot, hot mess. Nudes for Jesus, you know. It was just, it was just <laughs> like one, one dump uh. the fire after another. What do you do when you get those as a woman, though? Do you look at you it? You show everybody and laugh. I, one morning, I got up to go to work, and I just, like, opened it. And I'm just like, what am I supposed to do with this? You show your girlfriends. <laughs> like, exactly. <laughs> but I'm just like, what do I do with this? It's, like, 5 in the morning. What would you rather have, a guy that sends those or a guy that's blowing into uh, a machine before he drives you on a date? Or both, like she yeah, has. That's terrible. <laughs> yeah, she had I'm both, just, didn't she? I forgot. <laughs> What if he sent like, one of him blowing in it and a nude? <laughs> that's, like, that's just like advice for guys. Don't talk about that kind of stuff on dates. And make sure you don't have a breathalyzer in your truck before you're going out if your <laughs> date doesn't know about it. Yeah, uh, I would lie. I think I would rather tell her that I didn't have a car. Should that be up front, though? If he's if if somebody has one, go, hey, Deborah, I, I'm going to pick you up. We're going to go out. But, you know, I did make a couple mistakes in my past, and I have to blow in. To a uh, a breathalyzer to start my car. In my past, though, I, it, it can't be that long ago that I, you did it. I, you can I have those things for like a year. Honesty, so I would rather know about it ahead of time. That way, I'm not just like, oh, okay. I won't judge a person as hard then, you know. How, how funny if he was drinking at the bar at the date and then he couldn't start his car. Oh my gosh, I would probably just walk home at that point. If you had to blow into it, would you blow into it for him? No. Oh my God. <laughs> Oh no, I'm too. I'm too. 
I'm too goody goody for that. Yeah. Oh. I guess. Uh, I don't know, but but not born again Christian like him. <laughs> no, no. <I'm, laughs> yeah, no. I, that's just one of many really bad dates, but yeah. Yeah. Well, can we get you on next week too then? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. But yeah, no. It's just first date stuff. Just like talk about your favorite shows, music, that kind of stuff. Don't be talking yeah. about religion and politics. Sorry, right, kind Deborah. Of a, it's kind of a well, date listen, killer. Thank you for coming on and sharing your story. We appreciate it. Thank you. Are you still single? Right. Do what? Are you still single? No. Oh. I tried to book twice. Sorry, okay, guys. we're done with you, then. <laughs> <laughs> See you later. Bye. Bye. Thank What's you. What's going on, on, y'all? This is Morgan Wallen. I'm a Mason Good. Good go. Oh my god, my rib cage is on now. So, Hannah, you doing okay? Am I doing okay? Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. Why okay. are you asking that? Let's see if you need anything. Oh, thank you. What can you do for me? <laughs> I made phone calls. <laughs> okay. Uh. uh... I want to go get today um, that thing I've been getting to eat. I don't want to say too many details. The one that's hard to say? No, yeah, but I, um, but I'm nervous I'm going to get judged because the guy remembered me. He remembered me going through. That's I feel right. like I'm that's going right. through too many times. That. Yeah, yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah, I'm embarrassed. Are you not talking about an Ahi bowl? But at least, yes. But at <laughs> least I'm getting something healthy. You know what I mean? It's not like I'm going through a drive through and like getting like a bunch of like crappy food. You know? Like you can't judge someone too much He's for not every day. Judge you. Just go get the food. I yeah. know. I'm going to. But <laughs> I'm embarrassed. Yeah, but he did recognize you, right? Like yeah. back again. Oh, but I have my car. I have my car back. Oh, yeah. And maybe I was recognizable because I tell you what, when I was trying to do drive throughs with that big car, it was <laughs> it was embarrassing. <laughs> it's hard to turn some of those corners. Yeah. Oh. What time is it? 7.57. Oh, my gosh. Do you not have the time? Yeah. There's look no, on your laptop. I do, but I got to flip. I got to push buttons. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I can't wait to see what you bring me back from California. It's gonna be good. Oh. It's gonna be good. <laughs> he already got it. <laughs> no, he does, he does not. He said it's going to be good. <laughs> it I just could be stories. Him. You know what I mean? It doesn't have to be some. You're not kind of gal that likes physical stuff. I don't content. know <laughs> who you're talking about. What girl are you talking about? <laughs> I love gifts. <laughs> I know you do. I know you do. Uh, but uh, you also just love good conversation, good storytelling. You can appreciate that. Yeah. Uh, I would. That's an expectation for you to bring back stories. You have to bring back stories. Oh, no way. The mountains are right there. What? Sun's coming up. There's mountains? Yeah. yeah I haven't seen those yet. <laughs> oh. oh, no way. There's a mountain right there. Oh. <laughs> uh. uh... My wife bought this trip for my birthday, Alexis. Hey, What's we don't have time. What do you Which mean? One can you just say it? Yeah. Just say it. We're all family here. Why is the menu? Why is the menu showing up now? Let me see. What oh. menu? On the PC, it's showing up on the screen. It wasn't before. Oh, I see what you're saying. On the bottom of the screen on Facebook. I don't know. The mit. I'm confused. It's like the bottom of the screen, you know, oh. like all the icons, the desktop. I got rid of it. Oh. Good job, Kenny. I knew you'd troubleshoot it. <laughs> Kenny, oh, Kenny, 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 Becky, Kenny, that's Kenny. exciting. She said her daughter, daughter Summer is due four weeks after you. When's the due date, Johanna? August 19th. August 19th. Yeah. And have I been having panic attacks? Yes. Do I recommend getting pregnant when your kids are the most terrors they've ever been? No, I don't. Because every day I think about how I'm bringing another one into the world. <laughs> are they, you have to remind me, are your, are uh, Frankie Philo, are they the three potty trained? Oh, no. We're working on it. Philo's really close. She just has never pooped in the potty. It's like she's just freaked out, which I yeah. understand. I'm saying, God, I'm girl. I just don't. <laughs> 
<laughs> it's probably his plopping on back in Goddard. You know what I mean? That's the worst. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> yeah, that uh, is the worst uh, direct uh, hit. You're like, what oh, in no. the hell? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, Frankie has zero interest, but I finally think I got him. He told me that if I buy him a Spider-Man potty, he will go in the potty. Really? Okay. Spider-Man or dinosaur. Okay. Yeah, so, yeah. Also, that's really hard to find. So, I think I'm going to just buy a potty and put stickers on it. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> and yeah, I, I want to kids. You, can fool kids. you know what? This is, you know what my motivation is to potty train my kids? I want a new rug really bad. I want a new rug. I picked out this perfect rug I want. But what I, don't, is, I don't understand why, how that's a motivation for them to get body trained. Because I, they run around naked and pee on stuff right now. I don't want them to buy the new rug and let them pee on my rug, my new rug. They're peeing like wild animals in your house and <laughs> rugs. not that bad. But there's like potential for it to happen. Oh, my God. <laughs> we were making fun of that other guy this whole time, and you had some in your own house. No, only when they're potty trained. Well, I haven't tried it. This is the thing. I haven't tried it with Frankie yet. Philo peed on the Philo's peed on the rug once because I just make her naked all day, and then like she goes potty because she doesn't like peeing on the floor or on herself. So then she'll just go to the potty. Frankie, I'm scared because when I start really potty training him, that boy's peeing on rugs. I know it. I just <laughs> I already know. So I'm waiting to buy my rug oh until my he's God, potty it's trained. Hilarious. Uh, Is he still pooping on the floor? No, I can't see either one. Frankie's like a super clean kid, though. Like, like he yeah. gets sticky, and he's like, ah. like I'm, I'll never forget the first time I put him in the grass. So I had them both in their little bouncer things, and it was the first time they ever touched grass with their feet. And Frankie was screaming, crying, had, pulled his legs up and wouldn't touch it. Like, it was like, look, gross. <laughs> like, the outdoors, ew. The outdoors. Ew. Oh, God darn it. We did that with our three boys, and it works. See, that's what everybody says. Well, do I make him go naked? Huh? Make him be naked? Make him be naked? Yeah, that's like yeah. a pretty normal way to potty drain. I've never. We didn't. I don't know. And it would. It, they, <laughs> good story. Oh. <laughs> 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 Knocked it out of the park. Uh, uh, so what you give no caffeine. Discount Gary. Discount Gary. I'll take him. You take discount Gary. I don't think so. <laughs> Have Gary potty train them as his IOU. His rugs can be at risk. I would never do that to Mickey Lynn. <laughs> She's got nice stuff in her house. Uh, I drove by your house the other day, Gary. There was a bunch of cars outside. Oh my gosh, these kids are partying. That's Little hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> oh my Two gosh, that would be so awesome. Oh, he's got a ring doorbell. Can't pull that on him. Yeah, but yeah, not on both doors. I got multiple rings. Don't even no, try it. No, you him. don't. Do you actually? Mm. I don't think you do. Yeah, I do. I'll, for the sake of your safety, because this is like live, I'll say, yeah, you do. But <laughs> I do. I for real do. I bet you he does yeah. for sure. I will see you. I will see you. That's creepy. We should go to his house, Johanna. I have no problem with that. Go use that trampoline. Is I I would use that trampoline. I'll take my kids and just <laughs> lock them in your backyard. Can the you park. lock? You can't in he your backyard. You don't have a fence. Never mind. I do now. I have a fence now. I lock them in all the you way. Buy that? Yeah. You want to buy the trampoline? No. Where am I going to put it on the hill? <laughs> <laughs> put it in the front yard. Oh, well, yeah. To let all the neighbor <laughs> kids so jump on it. <laughs> you know what really sucks? I just bought all new stuff for my front porch, like super cute bench, super cute basket things, stuff that I needed to spray because I'm not sure if it's meant to be outdoors. And then it just freaking snowed all over it. I think it probably ruined my bench, huh? That's fine. It was not supposed to snow, was it? It was supposed to be a light dusting. There's no dust. Because it's supposed to snow on Thursday, I think. No, shut up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Are you for real? Yeah. I'm One moving. to three inches unless they changed it. I'm going to move. I'm moving. Where are you going? I don't know. I already feel like my bones are aching. You know, like old people get Yeah, Yeah, bones my bones ache all the time. Yeah, me too. I understand now. Like my knees hurt when it's like I can feel the storms coming. 
Wednesday, chance of <laughs> rain and snow. <laughs> chance for snow on Thursday. Uh, yeah, I feel that way all the time, Joe, you know. Yeah. It's, it's, it's a rough, it was a rough life, you know. It's been a rough one. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Am I going to get, um, I know we do joke godfathers and stuff like that. Because they really have godfathers. Uh, you are their godfather. I know, I joke one. No, you're literally on the paper. Mm-hmm. I swear to you, I'll send you a picture today. You are literally on a paper that says Godfather Gary Greenwood. Didn't you better show me a paper. For which one, though? For Frankie. <sighs> but you can inherit Philo. Okay. Now, because she's like, has no one. <clears throat> <laughs> what about this new one? Oh, <clears throat> Kyle wants to be the Godfather, it sounds like. <laughs> what? Hey, um, what do you, um, what does Dane want? I don't, we, we haven't even talked about it. I'll go to the church really? and everything. Yeah, we haven't talked about it at all. What we I want. Think it's, I think that's it's a little early, right? Uh, I to think start talking about no. godparents. Halfway. Oh, get, God, godparents, no. We, he's talking about if we want a boy or a girl. Oh. I, mm-hmm. I don't care. I don't care. Yeah. That's the best way to do it. You don't want to be disappointed. Yeah. Well, I think too, since we had a, bo- I got really lucky. I had a boy girl right off the bat. So yeah. I so mean, whatever you get now, it's whatever. just gravy. Yeah. yeah. I, th- I mean, I think about things like did I don't I think did I tell you this like Frankie is Frankie was a super like clingy baby. Like I could mm. never put him down. Yeah. And Philo was super independent. Like just did whatever. Like she was the easiest baby of all time. Yeah. But now that they're older, like Philo is like a lot harder to parent. She doesn't really, yeah. She, I mean, she's just smart and like she's she, like being three is just a crazy age already, yeah, you know. And she yeah, just is like, yeah. she's too smart, but still three, you know. And right, like, right, 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 right. That's hard. Frankie, like, literally, I can like look at him and he'll go sit in timeout. Philo's right. like, why? Why do I need to sit in timeout? Like, when yeah. I need to explain things to her, I'm like, I don't know, <laughs> just go sit down. <laughs> You should have made coffee in your room. Yeah, people are smart. I know. I thought of Why that. Why didn't I do that? I literally have been thinking about this the whole time, but I didn't say anything because I was like, no way he's that stupid. Yeah, I am. Why You're did that I do stupid. that? I even saw it last night. You're literally God, that I'm stupid. I'm an idiot. Oh, my gosh. It's not good coffee anyway, but probably just as good as what I'm drinking. Why didn't I do that? Can you just run up there after this next break? and? I can't leave this. I'm in California, man. I can't leave this appointment down here. <laughs> What's up, bro? What time is it? Who, eight what? o'clock there? It's not eight o'clock there, is it? You can just leave it on that counter, or no, you can just bring it in here. That's fine. Oh yeah, Hi, we're almost Mark. done anyway. You can just set it down there. You can leave it in the bag for now. We're gonna go on the air here in a second. Oh gotcha. Actually, better yet, I'll just give it to you guys after you know after everything. Well, not after, after you guys are off the air. Cause I got some uh, stuff you want to. Okay. Okay. That yeah, just take it with you. There you go. No, <laughs> he's so nice. He sounds like a lot of glassware. <laughs> I heard some cleaning going on. Like, like a lot of bottles. Yeah. Scott, I asked him, and they're going into the water. water. No, I do not want to drink in this. Hmm? You should be all right. They've been working on the roads. <sighs> You don't understand. I like. I know how bad you are of a driver. It's not just. A, I just like. I'm just have really bad anxiety when I drive. Like terrible anxiety when I drive. It's not that I'm. I always say I'm a bad driver. I'm not that bad of a driver. I just am very anxious. Then use that and don't say you're a bad driver. It gets funnier. Just, it's funnier to say I'm bad. It's not funny to say you're an anxious driver. You know what I mean? That's not funny. Yeah, but I could take you more seriously. <laughs> what? <laughs> take you you take seriously. me more seriously. Yeah. I don't want to be taken seriously. <laughs> oh, April says, uh, don't use the seconds. room coffee and makers are rarely clean. <gasps> yeah, at this point, I think Gary will take Who anything. Who cares? It's hot enough. Water will kill the bacteria. Yeah. Yeah. You're fine. That's true. Oh. Oh. <laughs>
The Tracy's Collision Cam is live. Facebook.com slash Froggy981. How when is that uh, Morgan Wallen show? Uh, Morgan Wallen going to be March 11th. That is this Friday. CHI Health Center with Hardy and Larry Fleet. Give us all the details, didn't Joanna? Yeah. It's my Larry, job. Larry Fleet is going to be there. I didn't know Larry's going to be there. Oh, Larry. Yeah. I'm really excited for that one. <laughs> <laughs> we were talking uh, last week about this show. We, we we're hearing the tickets are $400, $500 a ticket for, for Morgan Wallen on uh, Friday. Yeah, that's insane. Now, we do have tickets you can win. If you go to our website, you can sign up to win them. That's one way. And then another way is you're going to see at some point today as post asking you what would you do for Wallen tickets. And we tried this before with Jason L. Was it Jason Aldean that we yeah, did it Yeah, it was. For? Do it for Aldean is what we did mm-hmm. in the past. Yeah. We had some good ones. We had a uh, baby burden. We had a... Uh, Assist two sisters. Yeah, baby bird vodka into their mouth. That was a that was a hit. They did not win though. The winning one was what? Do you remember? It was uh, Col- Colton who ran around oh. naked. And remember, it was like literally like negative degrees out that day. Yeah, and he yeah. ran around his um, apartment building naked. Right. Well, and we- rumor had it that he stuffed he stuffed his Chills. underwear with the sock. That's what they said. How can it be no. negative degrees and there be such a bulge? Like I just. <laughs> 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 I just know ladies' eyes go right there. Like I didn't even notice it. I didn't even. What, did you Whatever. notice it immediately? I didn't notice it. I wasn't looking there. Okay, what? You act like it's not weird where you go. Where do you go? Calves. Oh. <laughs> I look at calves. That's you weird. I know at, it that's is. Super weird. <laughs> yeah, but it's not sexual. That's I, what I mean by that. It's not sexual. Sometimes you just want to see what someone's packing. You know. <laughs> <laughs> so with this with the morgan wallen tickets we're gonna we're gonna leave it up to you i don't know how this is gonna go but uh, we want you to start thinking about it now it's well, what would you do for wallen tickets really now get crazy with it don't say uh tell me what to do we don't want to tell you what to do you tell us what you would do and we'll pick your idea and you'll have a chance to win tickets for this sold out show on friday oh also, I, the issue we had last time, too, was people were like, oh, tell us what to do. And then you would come up with an idea, and they go, nah, I'm not going to do that. Yeah. This, yes. <laughs> thank you for bringing that up, because I don't want any of this BS, I do anything. And then I ask you to pick your friend's nose and eat it, and you say no. <laughs> I don't, <laughs> I'm not dealing with that this time around. Okay? Also, if you really want to get me, the one that disappointed me the most that we weren't able to have on, uh, two guys were going to give each other hickeys. And I want to That's so- a winner. They're going to Wallen. No, I'm you're you going that. to Wallen. <laughs> yeah. Absolutely. So if you, yeah, if you have, if you have good ideas well, like happened, that. If we can just talk about that one for a minute, what happened there is they agreed to do it, but they were drinking. I, and yeah. then so the next morning. The one guy, he woke up and he's like, I'm still in. So he drove to his buddy's house, <laughs> knocking on the door. His buddy wouldn't answer the door because he remembered that the night before he said that he's going to give him a hickey <laughs> on the air. And then he tried to get his employee to give him a hickey. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, just do it, man. He's like, no. Uh, and then did so we bring in like sucking toes too, right? Uh, then we bring oh, sucking toes into it for a second. Yeah, yeah. We offered. There's we said he, he could just suck his toe, so there wouldn't be any evidence. But we're not. open to anything. Uh, you'll see us <laughs> posted here today, and then Wednesday, maybe even Thursday, we're going to be doing it on the air. You'll have a chance to watch it on the cam, and then maybe even vote on your favorite. That kind of deal, kind of like what we did last time. So that'll be posted really soon. What would you do for Wallen tickets concert on Friday night with Froggy ninety eight? Our country club. We- Mm. 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 (laughs) yeah she says i was in the fort and a guy was trying on jeans looked fine in the jeans (laughs) 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 Uh, deb you thirsty Uh. girl kenny at some point brooke's gonna jump in so or keep an eye on that okay She's going to jump on the Zoom. Comment nice butt. What? Did you tell him nice butt? To his face? Wilbur Dane. I don't like that name. Gary, you want some... Co- Never mind. <laughs> that was rude. I'm so rude. He got a reputation for being rude around there. You know what I mean, Joe? 
Just me and you. Oh, we do? I didn't do He it. does. Kyle does. Kyle? Me and you are like this. Thick as thieves, they would say. Someone say thick as thieves. That Always got each other back. Mm, interesting. Always, huh? Mm. <laughs> hmm. Not with yeah. life changing news, apparently. No, not with that part. You got to compartmentalize it. Mm. That part is incredible, exciting news. <laughs> life changing. So excited. I can't hardly even stand the news. Listen, I know. The other part, my buddy ain't going to be with me for six weeks. Men have waffle Sad brains. News. You were, like really exemplified everything I learned about psychology in that moment. Men yeah. have waffle brains. You were in the, there was a compartment somewhere in your brain that was actually happy for my family. Very happy. Very happy. You have no idea how happy. What I'm disappointed in you in is like that you couldn't, you didn't go to that compartment first. I tried to get that waffle. You I could not get, walk over to the other <laughs> waffle compartment. I was stuck in that crater. You know how those waffles know. got craters? I, I was know. in that crater, that little individual crater. I could not get out of it. Yep, and here I was in my pancake brain, just all the t- fears and everything swimming around. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it was bad. Not my best moment. Oh, Marley, I'll eat a raw anchovy. Uh, no. You know what my husband likes? I cannot believe this. What? Pickled herring. I don't even know what that is. I've heard it. It sounds like a movie. Is there a herring movie? That sounds right. I think you're it right. Does, but does, no. it? Yeah. Like blue herring. Yeah. Red herring. Red herring. There you go. What is Kenny. that? That's like uh, something they put in to distract you, right? A red herring? Yeah. Yeah, but is that a movie? That's a movie term or a story term. Look at this guy, full of knowledge. I love it. Um, Kenny, I would want you on more often. Um, anyway, pickled herring, it's like a jar of freaking fish, like pickled fish, and he eats it on crackers. It's like a sardine? Yeah, and it looks like snake skin. That's gross. Who does that? My husband. You know, it's one of those things that I kind of wish he would have told me before I said yes to marrying him. <laughs> you think I want to be with a guy who, like, eats pickled herring? No. No, I don't. What's this heavy? Would you kiss him afterwards? No. Would you rather no. kiss him after that or a guy that's chewing tobacco? Oh, I think I'd take the tobacco. You would? In the I mouth? Don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. You want me to tell you a terrible story right now? Sure. We got time. Did the Huskers win yesterday? I'm sorry. Yes. Wow. Go Big Red. Um, So, one time I was at a party. I was at a party. There were a lot of boys at this party. And I was out talking to someone out on the front porch. And there was like this banister. And I had set my beer there. And then... I'm talking, oh, talking, yeah. talking. Tell me about this. And went and got my beer. I told you this. And I yeah. took a big drink. And there was a ton of people listening to me talk and tell a story or something. You swallowed it, right? And it was chew spit in the... Yeah, and I swallowed it. Because I was too God, embarrassed. That's so gross. <laughs> I was too embarrassed to say anything. Uh, oh, my gosh. It makes me ill just thinking about it. I can't believe I did that. Yeah. Getting ready for breakfast, huh, Gary? Are you guys ready for we breakfast? We can hear it. <laughs> April says it's an acquired taste. Why? Acquired taste makes no sense to me. Why do you want to acquire a taste? If you have a first taste and you say no, oh, just say, keep saying no to it. Are you talking about for the chew? Are you talking about the herring? The herring. Yeah. It's an acquired taste. You know what I mean? Like, why do you acquire? Why would you want to acquire a taste of something? Unless it's all know. you have to eat for the rest of your life, then I'd want to acquire a taste for it. But otherwise, there's lots of options in the world. You don't need to acquire a taste. But he had to acquire it from his family too. You talked to his dad. Who who got him eating the fit? The I don't herring. know. Sounds like a good grandpa thing, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. <laughs> I don't know. Ah, oh, see, yep, Andy did the same thing as me. Oh, we gotta stick together. Is uh, is Brooke close? Yeah, she's in the waiting room. Oh, she is. Do we want to go at 8.20 or after? What do you mean? Well, I can play two songs or one song. But but don't, yeah, just go at 8.20. Okay. Right? Yeah, then we'll go. That's when the break is, typically, so that's what I usually do. 
Oh, I forgot. Christina's never had bacon. She said, I'll eat a piece of bacon for the first time in my entire life for Morgan Wallen tickets. How have you never eaten bacon? I know you guys didn't believe in it, but now why don't you eat it? Do you still not? I don't, I don't understand. Neither. I did just read this whole article, though, about how it was from a chef about how he doesn't like pork at all. And he sh- and he showed a picture of like a a tumor and a piece of pork, and he said that most most places just cut out the tumor. I told didn't I tell you that my brother in law got a deal on him. I told you that story. I think you did. Yeah, a whole hog, and he asked why it was so cheap, and he said because it was tumor it was a tumor pig. And he still took it. He still took it and ate it. Tracy's Collision Cam is live. Search Fraud Mornings on YouTube. Okay, so I think Brooke is going to join us, I think. I hope so. Yeah, she's she's uh, about to get in. Live from Nashville. God, I keep saying Nashville. She's in Vegas for the ACMs. She's the voice of the Academy of Country Music Awards. They flew her out there over the weekend and... Uh, that is, it's tonight, is, isn't it? Yeah, it's tonight on, on Amazon Prime. Yeah, tonight, wow. 7 o'clock our time uh, is when it will start. Uh, there's a pre-show at like 6 o'clock. Hey, Brooke. Hi, bro. Hi. How are you? I'm good. I'm sleepy. Very sleepy. <laughs> yeah, tell me about it. I'm over here in California. Oh, where? what are you doing in California? Uh, you know, just jet setting pretty much. Like He's a world traveler. <laughs> no, my wife bought my wife. Uh, it's for my birthday, so I'm out here just for a couple of days, just hanging out. So I'm tired with you, Brooke. I know that you're also tired because you've been working. You're getting ready for the ACMs, uh, which are tonight on Amazon Prime. Uh, who have you met? What celebrities have you seen? So I haven't. Unfortunately, I haven't met anybody. Um, but I got to see Dolly, who looks gorgeous. She's glamorous. She's beautiful. Really? Oh, I've always wanted to see Dolly. That's so cool. Oh, my gosh. And can I just tell you, hearing, like, my voice say, this is Dolly Park. Like, and then she comes out on stage. I cried a little. Not oh, lie. my gosh. <laughs> Did you get, like, video of that? Are you going to be? I guess it's all on TV, right? Or you can yeah. record it. Yeah. That is so Hopefully amazing. I'm not allowed to take any video, so. You can't take any videos, oh. really. I would have snuck in a GoPro for sure. Like put it in my bra. <laughs> on your head. No, in my Just bra. Just walking around with it. <laughs> your bra. Yeah. I used to have like, a camera or something, you know. Uh, so did you do, did you have to do like uh, um, rehearsals then? Yeah, so I had to stay for all the rehearsals. And uh, if there were any script changes that needed to be corrected, I had to kind of uh, re-record those. I did get to see... Uh, like I said, I mentioned Dolly. I got to see Kelsey Ballerini. I got to see uh, Kelly Clarkson. Wow. Um, Robert Hayes. Um, Chris Stapleton. Yeah. Uh, Do you get to walk the red carpet tonight? Fingers crossed. But just show just up. Just go. Yeah. I am the voice yeah. of the ACMs. If anybody I think I, quite- should. I think I should. Yeah, you just say, "Do you know who I am?" And then yeah. you walk through. It's not like they can't. Yeah. They won't question you at all. And it's not like they can't use your voice. Like it's too late. They can't get anybody else. It's true. Mm-hmm. Like, what do they do? You mean like if they kick her out? Like, hey, <laughs> I'm Brooke Summers. I'm walking the red carpet. <laughs> Sorry, Brooke. You can't. Yes, I am. So and then the, for the for the for the show tonight, are you? Do you have a seat, or are you like backstage in case they need you? Where Where will you be? So I have a booth. I'm in a booth in case they need me, and I get to just kind of watch the whole thing from the booth. And if they they say, "All right, you're on," and then I put my little headphones on. Oh my god, how crazy! <laughs> Is that just making you nervous in case you have to do that? I'm trying not to think about it. I'm hoping. <laughs> <it was> <laughs> uh, you're gonna be. You're gonna kill it. You're gonna be wonderful. Thank you. But you guys got to watch it. I'm telling you, the performances, there's some I can't, there's some surprises that yeah. blow you away. Wait, you can't and even tell us about the surprises? We're family. <laughs> I, know. I know. That's awesome. I'm just going to tell you, there is there is a like big music blog. Okay. It's going to be a lot of fun. That's awesome. You, do you know who is, who's won certain categories? They don't tell you any of that, do you? Because when you announce, you're just announcing who's presenting pretty much, aren't you? 
Please right. come on, on stage. Yeah. Even in practice, they just kind of say for the purpose of this practice, this right. is, so nobody knows the winners. Right, right. Um, and then after parties tonight? I'm trying to go to all of them. So yeah. tomorrow, if I sound even you know more tired, that's why. Yeah. And when do you come back to uh, good old Lincoln, Nebraska? Tomorrow afternoon. Tomorrow afternoon. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. So I'll be asleep on the plane if I go to all your parties. <laughs> uh, it looks like they are really, you look tired. It looks like they, they're really working you, aren't they? It was a 12 hour day. 12 hour day. 12 we don't do that. You tell them you're in radio, right? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> What are you talking about? <laughs> uh, well, we look forward to seeing it tonight. Again, it's, it's on Amazon Prime. And um, if you don't have Amazon Prime, Brooke. You free trial membership. It's 30 days. You just sign up. It's real simple. Sign yeah. up and, you know, enjoy the show because it's going to be really good. Yeah. yeah. They're hosting along with Dolly. Um, Kelly Clarkson is going to be performing. It's it's a good show. And it's oh. making for Amazon because it's the first time they've ever streamed Exclusive right. To the show. Right. Yeah. Well, I'm sure it's going to be, uh, it's going to go off uh, well. And we, we look forward to hearing your voice tonight, Brooke. Thanks, guys. All right. Good luck. We'll see you later. Bye. 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 <laughs> sure. This <laughs> happened. I do hear Kyle at the end of that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> well, I don't know. She looks so like funny. she is misspent. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Getting PTSD over here. Look at all these people saying. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Everybody's <laughs> lighting Kyle up. Brooke shows up. Gary shows up. Kyle leaves. F the show. I have to go. Play. <laughs> I'll just be back. We're having a little watch party at my house tonight, Johanna. If you want to come over, yeah. Oh, for real? Yeah. Would you allow children? Yeah. Are you serious? Yeah. I'm gonna take better off. You're doing a watch party, huh? Yeah, bro. Huh. little watch party it'll be fun how's your dog doing he's good he's uh right now the cancer isn't like super aggressive so they think if things stay the same it might be old age before cancer but i think he'll obviously get to a point too where life sucks and you have to make that tough decision yeah yeah is that what you guys did, right? Had to make that tough decision. Oh, we waited forever. Yeah. Like our dog's legs were gone. <clears throat> yeah. So I got her a wheelchair and then I was carrying her outside to go to the bathroom. Yeah. Like it got to the point where it was just not like, just not a good life for her. So we probably waited even a year longer than we probably should have, but mm. it's tough, man. Tough yeah. to do that. Yeah. I get it. Especially you guys, like it's your kids. Yeah. But um, well, I hope everything works out there. We'll do next. The uh, uh, is it the eight forty break next? No, eight thirty. There's no eight thirty. You got to play some songs to get to eight forty. What? So for short music. I smell coffee, I think. Well, there's... Go get it. Mm-hmm. Look out. I see someone. So, that was only our second break this hour, which should have yep. been 820, right? Yep. The next one is 40 and then 50. I have a 40. So, do we... We're out before the ag report is what you're saying, right? The ag report is the last break, yeah. So there's two breaks left. There's the coffee, I see it. <laughs> you see how quick he turned? Is that coffee? It's not. Oh, I just like an idiot. Look I'm at sorry, like sorry. <laughs> All right. Staring at you. 40. I, speak, I, I don't know Spanish. Oh no. Do you remember how to say hello? Hola. No. <laughs> Don't say it right now. <laughs> Chacho. Hola, muchacho. Oh, good job. <laughs> That's really good. Amigo. Use amigo. Hello, brother. Hola, amigo. Hola. 
It's not hola, is it? That's yeah, how, do you say, how do you say hello, acquaintance? <laughs> acquaintance? <laughs> yeah. Hola something? Because you don't say coffee? hello, friend, to people you don't know, do you? How do you say coffee? How do you say coffee? Arriba. <laughs> Hurry. <laughs> <laughs> Chicharrones. Say that you want some chicharrones. It's coffee. You just looked it up. What is it? It's coffee. It's coffee. Coffee. <laughs> coffee. Cafe. Cafe. Hey. Yo necesito coffee. Oh, yo necesito oh, coffee. Cafe. Say yo necesito cafe. Oh, also, I bet, you they, I bet I'm you they. Aloha now. <laughs> I bet you they speak perfect English too. By the way. Here this is Aloha Necesito Cafe. <laughs> oh. Oh. You get it figured out, Kyle. Yeah. Por favor. Por favor. Por favor. You can speak Spanish like, oh, we, Amar. Oh, Amar. There. Me. I know, I totally forgot about him. Yeah. Where is he? Is he there? I yeah. think he's in the he's waiting in the room. room. He can come in right now. Yeah, just have him come in. That's fine. I don't think there is breakfast or coffee. Well, I thought you said you smelled it. Gary, you're paying for that one. Congratulations. What? Hannah's having a baby. What? Yeah. Did he leave? What? No, he's here. No, on the on the TV screen. Oh, Amy, somebody does care about do me. I had her do that. No. Thank you, Amy. Thank you for Thank doing you, that for me. You're such a liar because I asked got her to Mark? do it last Friday. <laughs> you did for real? You asked her to do it? Oh, that's going to make me cry, Kyle. That's really nice yeah, of you. We went in there and said, up, listen. <laughs> we, yeah, we did. Gary, was we have to do it. whatever it takes. She is pregnant, guys. What's up, Amy? What? Did you find something? We're good. good. Hey, does he have that microphone? Can he? Oh. So then everybody can hear you. Otherwise, it sounds silly. Tell him to talk to his fans. Talk to your fans. Hey, good morning, everybody. How are um, ah, Sorry, early morning. I can't even think straight. <laughs> Anyways, um, how's everybody doing this morning? Um, I'm doing good. <laughs> and as you can tell, I just woke up. So, you know, ha I'm just half asleep. Just can't even think straight. <laughs> <laughs> we did like an eye roll with that. That was nice. <laughs> yeah, my brain feels kind of broken right now. <laughs> tell me about it. You got the broken brain. You got pregnancy brain like me. Uh, I can. I know how you feel, but of course I'm a guy. So yeah, yeah. So you, yeah, you'll never know. I know. No. <laughs> <laughs> You'll never know. <laughs> um, so, so like I said, I got some. Uh, uh, I I got a gift for um, for Kyle, Kyle uh, Johanna, and then Gary. Awesome. So, so I've been working on it for quite some time now. So um, have you? Are you going to present them to us right now? I am. Yay! And this is a um, this is a perfect uh, ugh, this is perfect timing because uh, right now the you know Froghead beer event I know we can't uh, drink Johanna. I so, can have a sip of beer it'll be fine. No <laughs> one for Gary. Not my grandchild. <laughs> I, uh, oh my God, your grandchild! Now you're taking <laughs> you're gonna take that role. It's got uh, it's got our names etched in it. And then the froggy logo on the back. And then oh, the frog. Oh. That so, is so awesome, Amar. You are so talented. Thank you. Yeah. Um, so last week I got um. Oh my I, gosh! I, upgr I upgraded my laser engraver. Um, so it's a lot, a lot it's a lot more strong. I'm able to laser laser engrave on glass, just about anything. And yeah, I that's think awesome. awesome. It took me about like half an hour to almost an hour just for one glass. Oh my word, that's amazing, Amar. Amar, you're awesome. Thank These you. These are so cool. You're welcome. And I thought, you know, hey, this is a, like I said, it's a perfect time because the Froghead beer event going on. Yeah. Yeah. Um, you know, this is the be best way to represent Froggy and everything else. That is so nice of you. That's amazing. And, you know, if anybody else is, interest, is interested in um, my laser engravement, just let me know. Just, you know, message me or. You, you know, better charge people. There. Don't do give away a bunch of crap for free. Oh, no. Just only for you guys. Nobody oh, else. Thank you. I mean, I'll take it for free anytime. <laughs> free is always good. <laughs> thank you. You're the best. You're this welcome. is a great size cup. I'm going to drink a lot of 
water out of this. Gotcha. And the good thing is, it's, it's a dishwasher safe, and um, you know, of course, I'd recommend just cleaning it first before using it. I mean, well, you know that. Well, everybody knows that. Yeah. <laughs> Apple juice for Johanna. Well, there you go. Perfect. I love apple juice. Certain kind, but I love apple juice. <sighs> Thanks, Thanks, Omar. What do you got going on today? Not much. <clears throat> yeah, right, bud? Yeah, just it's something early in my throat. Morning. Yep. <laughs> throat stuff in the morning. <laughs> Not much. Just clean the house. Just um, just yeah. run a few errands, go to work, just go home, start all over again. <laughs> <laughs> all I do, all I do is sleep and work, sleep Start and work. All over again. Well, I hope you have a great Monday. Oh yeah, anytime. Um, but before I leave, do you guys need anything else? You keep asking that every time we see you. It's so kind that you yeah. do that. But no, we don't need nothing. Golden. Thank you. You're welcome. Well, um, I hope everyone has a great day. I hope you have a great day, and um, also you, Johanna, and and Kenny. Thank you. You're welcome. Take care, everybody. All right. Tell him I said thank you. Gary says thank you. You're welcome. We'll see you. Appreciate you, Mark. Bye. Anytime. That was nice of him, huh? Yeah, it was really nice. Did you hear how he said um, something like thank you and if you guys need anything? And you too, Johanna and Kyle. So he was just specifically talking to Gary. (laughs) No, he wasn't. Yeah, he was. No, he wasn't. Deb, my favorite kind of apple juice is honest kids apple juice. I don't know why. It's the best kind. It's like not as potent or something. It tastes like watered down, kind of. I don't know. It's all natural. That's why I like it. Um, Gary looks like he's about to fall asleep. Oh, I got a sneeze and it hurts my ribs. He's waiting oh. for that cough. Oh, oh gosh! Oh my god! Oh. I can't believe you're still in so much pain. Hasn't it been three weeks? What? Hasn't it been three weeks? It takes two to three months to heal. Mm, I see. That's fun. This guy's worried about me complaining about being pregnant, and I've had to listen to him complain about his ribs for how long? Who said they're worried about you complaining about <laughs> you being pregnant? You said some BS stuff on Friday. Yeah, you did. About me, like oh no, we don't have to deal with her being hormonal. <laughs> yes, you did. Not one yes, time. Yes, you did. Yes, not you one did. time. Well, now what I did say in a roundabout way, going back and get me back in the waffle. What I did say was, <laughs> is that I was going to have to do everything, but that wasn't. That was because of a physical ability. When, what what's what? Name one thing I wasn't able to do. I worked all the way Just up until the week I had the me. twins. I know. Just hear me out for a second. I'm saying, like remotes, you can't lift heavy equipment. I Kyle, never did before. I never I did. I know, Johanna. <laughs> Listen, none of it makes any sense what I was saying. But that's what I was. It wasn't hormonal. I would never say I'm not that stupid. I would never say that. Uh, you should None of it. I, I can't justify any of it anyway. It was I ridiculous. Know. You can't. You should see the yeah. picture. You know that picture I have of you. That big picture I have at my house. The one um, above the, big, the mantle. The big one above my mantle. Yeah, you should see how many yeah. darts are in your forehead. Put them all when you shot right from my forehead. I threw darts at you. My husband's calling me. Hold on. You're on speakerphone. Hello? Do you want to be on speakerphone or do you want to be off? Be off on you? What? what? <laughs> 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 well, sex jokes. <laughs> okay, what? Oh, a fever. oh my gosh! Okay, awesome. I'm probably gonna call today. I will call today. You should also call your doctor. I will. Okay. And I'll text Sarah to see if she got the name of that. That'd Otherwise. be great. Do all those things. Yeah, you do some things. Okay. Love you. All the clothes, strip the bed, make it. Okay, do you want to act more tough? Like, what else? Say some more things. He's telling you what to do. Uh, <laughs> yeah, he's giving me yeah, a list. No job, ah! <laughs> okay. Love you. Bye. <laughs> I'm hanging up on him. Files had a fever all weekend. That's she. Yeah, she threw up Friday. Five three, seconds. Three times. 
Baby, there you are. Listen to your favorite morning show on the Tracy's Collision Cam. Every morning. Just head over to Facebook. Facebook.com slash Froggy981. So I've been watching the um, the NFL draft, not the draft, the combine. Have you guys been watching that at all? No. What? Yeah, I know. I watch a little bit of it. I don't know. The combine? Yeah, just I like watching them on the 40 yard dash. It's really stupid. Combine to me is a tractor. What? A combine? <laughs> I don't know what you're saying. <laughs> she got to go play. This is, where the, this is where the best players go and they get scouted and then they do that before the draft. And the reason I even bring it up is because of Cam. Cam Jurgens, who is our guy. He went? He w- yes. So he was our, we had an NIL deal with him where uh, he was the voice of, I don't know, of us kind of during the football season, right? He yep. would, he used his name and, um, and we got a chance to meet him. He's a super nice guy. Well, he was the talk of the combine. Really? Because of his beef jerky. <laughs> no way. This dude, yeah. This dude brought with him bags upon bags of his beef jerky his Man. uh what what is it called beef jerky beef jerky jerky, <laughs> jerky jerkins or i don't called? even know what it's called it's like this like just like one letter different <laughs> what's his beef jerky called again <laughs> but he was going in and he was talking to all these nfl teams and he brought them all bags of beef jerky Jerky. Brilliant. <laughs> jerky. Jerky jerkins. Jerky. I don't know. They loved it though. And now that they're, they're everybody's talking about him. And they, not only that, but he I, I guess he did really well. That's smart. It's like when you're like, you know, in school and you want to be like homecoming queen and you bring everybody cupcakes or something when they're on the day that they're voting. Yeah. Smart yeah. smart move. Yeah. Do you remember when he came to the station? I don't know what I was I don't know what I was expecting, but he pulled up in the old farm truck. Yeah. Yeah, that's why when you said combine, I thought this was a whole different story. <laughs> I was like, oh, he's farming now, huh? <laughs> he's going to get drafted high, I think, guys. I think he's going to do well for himself. So, when, when is the draft? It's in April. Is it? Yeah. There's a couple in a uh, couple of Nebraska guys that are working out trying to make it, but yeah, they loved him though. That's all I wanted to say is that the, the whole beef jerky. I don't know if he's making any money off this thing or not. Not if he's giving he, away bags and bags. <laughs> well, they were plugging it too. I think they even gave his website out. I'll be honest. I think I'm going to buy some today now. Yeah. Yeah, you should. I want to try it. I just want to know. I would imagine it's good. I don't know though. There's two have, different guys. kinds of beef jerkies though. You know what I mean? Like there's like the crunchy really dry kind. I've had some nasty stuff. Even when you go to the, uh, you know, you go to a convenience store, you're like, oh, this looks good. Yeah, and then it's not. I know. Not so good. Yeah, so support him. I don't know. Kenny, do you know, Kenny's in the studio. You're a kind of a sports guy. Do you know where you can get it? Is it only like through his website? Um, I'm not for sure. I think that that sounds right, though. Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) Thanks, Kenny. (laughs) You're listening to Froggy 98. Uh, Check us out while you're... You're funny, Kenny. <laughs> I'm looking right now. I love me some Kenny. I love me some Kenny. Kenny, have you gotten any uh, like any girl requests or anything? Uh, no, not really. No, meeting on the show. Nothing. I don't know if we're allowed to do this, but can we just like put his? I love the smile when he bites his lower lip. <laughs> oh, that's hot. How do, you see do it what? again, Kenny. Can you see you don't even know how. You can't recreate it. I bet, but try. How do you see me? He can see he can you. See you. Gary can I can see, see you, you, but the cam can't see you. So you can try turn, again. You can turn Kenny, yourself you... on the cam, Kenny. Don't no, make him. Right. If he doesn't want to, he doesn't yeah. have to. It's just for our eyes. Kenny, let me see if you can recreate it, though. Have you had any girl requests? <laughs> uh, no, not really. <laughs> yeah, he started to. Bit. He started to. Now he's self There it is. Ah! <laughs> I'm trying. No, it's not the same when you're trying. No, it's never the same when you're trying. It really isn't. If anybody wants to meet Kenny, it's Kenny Larrabee on Facebook. Can someone come <laughs> take care of my kids if they're going to be sick today? Because Yeah, you I... can't bring your kids over if they're sick. Yeah, I probably won't bring my kids over. But it's just Philo. I think that's why I'm going to take care of the doctor. Frankie has zero symptoms, and she's been literally sick since Friday. That's a long time. Mm-hmm. But she wasn't, like, sick at all yesterday. <sighs> 
Yes, Stephanie. Johanna is pregnant. Yeah, yeah she is up. pregnant. Oh my gosh. Pregnant. I really regret telling you. I wish I would have just waited until you like saw me first. That would I think that that is uh, the funniest thing you could have done. I know, but I couldn't have. Like I, I know, like wanted I you, you can, so but... bad, but I couldn't have. Yeah, the idea is to not tell anybody, just just get bigger, 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 bigger. <laughs> <laughs> Until somebody has to say something. You have to say, do they, I'm though? pregnant. Do they, though? Or do they just have to just assume I'm fat? I know at some point you're not. Like you, listen, I've seen <laughs> I've seen big people with babies that have babies, and they don't look pregnant. Like I know. Sister Kisser girl. Sister Kisser, my cousin. But I don't. My sister. She was, she was, she's a bigger girl now. And she was pregnant, and I she'd know, have to tell it. people I'm pregnant. Like, you know what I mean? Like you couldn't just look at her and tell. I don't get like a belly though. It's like mine is like my whole belly. Like I like it's not like like a little bump right here. It's like all of me it just gets fat. That was the same with the twins, and I thought it was just because it was the twins, but I think it's just yeah. the way my body goes. It's annoying. Except when I was worried there was something wrong. There were, I should have taken a picture. I had like a like right below my boobs. It was just a little bump. It looked really strange. It was like, there's no way a baby's up there, but maybe some organs were sticking out. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> it's just not, nothing about being pregnant. It's a good time. I wonder if you'll feel lighter with just one in there. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Like, you know what? Like the last month, the last month of being pregnant with the twins, I couldn't walk because there was so much pressure. Like it felt like a baby was going to fall out of me. So I'm like curious if that will be different. That's what I'm saying. It's like running. Have you ever trained? Probably not with one of them weighted vests. No, I've never trained <laughs> with a weighted vest. <laughs> See, the weighted vest would be like two babies. And then no one baby, you take off of the weighted vest. You're like, well, this ain't so bad. Like you'd be skipping and stuff. <laughs> I think that you'll, I could have a lot of energy. Yeah, maybe. I feel good right now. I don't even feel pregnant right now, which was not the way it was with the twins at all. Nobody I felt... could tell. I know. I don't know. I really had no idea. I was so clueless. I know. You know what I wish I would have said when I touched that? Because <laughs> it also felt like this. It felt like an anal thermometer. You wish you would have said anal thermometer? Yeah, to embarrass you. Why? I would have said, yeah. <laughs> you say that's your anal thermometer? You're the one touching my anal thermometer. <laughs> <laughs> but you would not want that in there. I don't care. Why would I care? Okay, you're talking tough now. You would not want an anal thermometer in that I, box that I would you not care. Used, personally used. I, why would I care? If you use some type of uh, feminine product and we put it in the box, you'd be fine with that? I do, would not care. You think I don't have problems with things that are just like normal life things. Like I have no problem. It's a normal thing. The worst part is, is that you have to touch it. Now, would I be embarrassed if it looked like there were poop? There was poop on it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that would be embarrassing. Uh. Uh. Johanna, I have had twins and single babies. The pregnancy with one will be way easier, I promise. Way yeah. easier. It's a good thing you had two out of the gate. Yeah, it is. Yeah. I've been really stressed, so I hope I'm I need to know the now. rules on this next one now, for real. Don't mess with me. Don't say, don't come up and see the baby when you want me to come up and see the baby. Tell me when I can you. and I can't. You made all of that up. I never said anything. I never, we never even discussed you guys coming. I never even, there was not even a conversation about that. You know what I think it was? I think you're right. I think it was more me and the other guy. We had an agreement that yes. we weren't going to just go up and surprise you when you may not look like you are presentable. <laughs> you know, like you would want to be presentable. I don't want to go over there and do some tests on you and stuff. You know what I mean? Like a I curtain. I'm like, oh. Yeah. Um, but he says, yeah, I'm going home. And then he sneaks up to the hospital to get brownie points. Yeah, that did happen. Yeah. Um, Which I will do this time. I'm just coming. I am coming right now. I don't know. I don't know now. I don't what think you, you don't deserve to see the child now. I already wrote set the up baby tripod, book. Set up tripod in there. 
You know, in the baby books when it says, Ah, daddy's first reaction, grandpa's first reaction, mommy's first reaction, our best friend's first reaction, finding out you're pregnant. I put, I wrote down exactly what you said. Please don't tell me you're pregnant. I, please don't tell me you're pregnant. I quit. (laughs) That was not caught on radio. That was not caught on radio. I quit. All my fears come to a head and then I'm just like crying. Don't say that. That makes me feel bad. It should. I hope it does. It should be. It does. So don't (laughs) say it. (laughs) Good job. You made me cry before. No, I did not make you cry ever. (laughs) You know what? He lied to me. When I told him I was pregnant with the twins, for years, for years, I thought that he was crying because he said, I'm going to cry. And then he said, he told me later, he said, I just said that for radio. I did not yes, say that. Yes, you did. You I, told me that you just said it for radio. That's not true. <laughs> yes. Go back and watch the footage. Zoom in. My voice started to tremble and everything. You're a voice actor. I know. You was like, I'm going to cry. <laughs> I'm going to cry. No, it got me. That moment got me for sure. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, oh. Yeah, Tara says she thought it was funny. You know what he said? It was lighthearted. To me, anyway. Tara, you listen. That's nice of you to think that, but I know this man. He was not pleased. <laughs> no, that's not true. You got to compartmentalize it. I'm okay. pleased for you. I'm so happy the for you guys. The compartment you were in was the not pleased compartment. <laughs> <laughs> I was in the Gary department for sure. Yes, through and through. But it really is. At the same time, I know it, it's a compliment to you, because some people. <laughs> Some people, I'd be like, please go away for six weeks. <laughs> Stay away longer, can you? Uh, you have to come back. Uh, but I don't even like you being gone a day. But that's because mm-hmm. I like you. I know. I'm taking it as a compliment. Am I still going to be mean to you about it? Yes, because you deserve it. But yes, but there's it's a, com- it's a uh, Yeah, I cried over Daisy. I did. It also is a uh, content. The Tracy's Collision Cam is live. Facebook.com slash Froggy 981. Who do we have tomorrow? Do we have anybody lined up for uh, I Do IQ? Yeah, yeah, we do. We're but, set, ready to go. Mm-hmm, well, we better check in with them because we sent, we, we <laughs> scheduled it a while ago. He sent me a message uh, oh, not too long ago. Perfect. I nice. love it. He's, do you know okay. this couple? Come yeah, on. I do. Um, Mike and Debbie, they're loyal listeners out in Grand Island that listen to us and he go he sent me a message this morning hey bud I guess Debbie volunteered us for something tomorrow are we still on for that yeah she wanted me to ask I said yes yeah. I do IQ do I even want to know what that is no. apparently he's not that great of a listener listen you know what happened on. last week they they volunteered to do I do IQ with a couple from last week, and mm-hmm. uh, they weren't, they didn't never heard it before. Did you see how good that went? It was terrible. Oh my God, it was the worst ever. Oh, it was so the worst bad. ever. Not to dog, but I think my Mike has a little more personality. He's, <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's going to be okay with it. <laughs> yeah, but Kyle, since these are your friends, can we go full force with the questions? So. Yeah. Yeah. Can we go are full you force? curious what's in there? You know what I mean? Because that's probably where we're going to end up. <laughs> It doesn't matter to me. But. Okay. Well, that's tomorrow. The uh, I Do IQ uh, challenge. Also, tonight, make sure to check out the ACMs. Uh, Brooke, who works at the radio station, she's afternoons. Uh, they were froggy. We're here at Froggy 98. She is in Vegas, and she'll be out there live for the um, Academy of Country Music Awards. So when you're here, if you're watching it on Amazon Prime, if you don't have Amazon Prime, you can get a, a free 30-day trial. Cancel it. If you don't want it after tonight, just yeah. so you can watch the show. But when you hear the voice, the person's introducing Dolly Parton and all these acts, that is Brooke, who works at the radio station. That's pretty cool. That's awesome. Yeah. So uh, check that out. And then if you miss any portion of the show today, go back and watch it. Kyle, what can they do that? Uh, you can rewatch it on Facebook, facebook.com slash froggy981, YouTube, Frog Mornings, and the Nebraska Now app, which you can download on your Apple, Roku, and Fire Stick TVs. What about Twitch? We're still on Twitch. And now. Twitch. And on Twitch. Twitch. And Twitch. Two and people Twitch. on Twitch. Thank you for all two people for watching on Twitch. <laughs> have a great day. We'll see you tomorrow. Uh, so have a wonderful afternoon. And we got some great music coming away next. What's going on, y'all? This is Morgan. Goodbye.
very well. I'm so tired. Oh, are you? Did